Adam Young and Jill Pod back with Cougar head coach Paula Busher. Cougars win by 11. Coach, that was a fun second half, wasn't it? That was a fun second half. It was, you know, I got to tell you, I really feel like there's just one thing. There's a lot of things. This game is not difficult. It's not complicated. We as coaches try to act like it's complicated so nobody else thinks they can do our job. But the honest thing is, it's about work ethic and it's it's about intensity. I mean, we, we slipped up there one time. We didn't sprint down and transition. And they pulled up and got a three. It's, you know, it, it's really about how hard you work. And I felt like tonight I was very proud of our team for how hard they worked for 40 minutes. That first half, you didn't shoot the ball well but you had energy, you had a good effort, didn't you? We shot it a lot, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> We, we did. We, we had good energy, and like I told them at halftime, I said I didn't have any issues with the shots in the first half that were attacking the basket. I had issues that maybe we thought there was going to be contact and weren't as tough as I needed us to be going to the basket. I said take it to that basket hard. I didn't see one time that we ran over somebody for a charge going to the basket, so I told them we're not taking it hard enough to the basket, but uh, we shot it often and a lot in the first half. I thought our shot selections were a lot better in the second half and led, obviously, to more baskets. Was there a conscious effort to get to the basket? Because you shoot nearly 70% in the second half, and, and we talked about the fact that if, if it wasn't going in, you were drawing contact and getting to the foul line. Really. What it was was, Joe, we just it was about aggressiveness. I, I think that's all I've been preaching for about 48 hours. It's not been a real happy 48 hours for them to be around me because I didn't like what we did the other night with our intensity. And then tonight, we stepped up and I thought played how we're capable of playing we didn't shoot the ball great, but you're right. Attacking the basket always causes things to happen, always. Raven Berry, another good game, but Ashley Capitosto in particular. Nine points, ten rebounds. She had four steals. You could count on a couple of hands how many hustle plays she had. Talk about Ashley. Energy. Ashley's in there because she brings energy, and, and I know, I don't know what I'm going to get scoring from Ashley every night, so I, I'm really pleased tonight, but we're always going to, she's always going to bust her tail, she's always going to communicate, and she goes hard with everything, and tonight I thought she took some great advantages when they double teamed Barry, Barry looked for her, got her some quick buckets, but then Cap didn't just stand out there, she went to the basket and made something happen. You play six off the bench tonight. How important is that, that you can get, and not necessarily the scoring, but you can get the minutes from that many folks off the bench, especially coming down to the end of February and into March? It was huge, and, and I think, Joe, the biggest piece of that was when we pulled people off the bench, they kept the score at bay. They didn't. We didn't lose points. We kept it right where we could, which allowed us to buy some minutes for other people and give them a rest. But I think it's huge for those players that came off the bench with their focus and their intensity to keep things going. Finally, Coach, is this the start to a strong finish for your team? I hope so, but we will stay on our team. We have to make sure we keep our heads in just simple. Work hard, respect the game, play for the school. Thanks, Coach. Great win. Thanks, Thank Coach. You. Thanks.